वेलकम टू एट ऑफ जून गॉडल ब्लेसिंग सुप्रीम फादर इज टॉकिंग अबाउट टू वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट एस्पेक्ट्स वन इज राज ऋषि एंड सेकेंड थिंग इज स्वराज्य अधिकारी दैट मीन्स मास्टर ऑफ सेल्फ स्व मीन्स सेल्फ राज्य मीन्स हैविंग कंट्रोल ओवर सेल्फ सो मास्टर ऑफ योर सेल्फ सो मे यू बी अ राज ऋषि एंड अ मास्टर ऑफ योर सेल्फ एंड बी विक्टोरियस ओवर योर सटल पावर्स and these subtle powers and even we explore them it is easy to become a conqueror of your sense organs the whole world out there is teaching us body language how to behave how to react how to think how to speak how to gesture out when you are in an interview when you are in hospitality service when you are giving a lecture what should be a body language we learn all those things and it becomes very unnatural inside we are feeling something else outside we are portraying ourselves as somebody else so god wants us to have a tandem that means he wants us to have a synchronicity between these two things what we are inside is what we express outside it is easy easy to become a conqueror of your sense organs but it requires subtle practice to become victorious over your mind intellect and sanskars these are very subtle pertaining to the soul the soul's mind the soul's intellect and the soul's habits to have control over them is not a physical aspect it is something to do with your own mind intellect and sanskars the soul has to give order to the mind and the intellect and the sanskars and make it behave in the way it wants it to your subtle powers easily to adopt the sanskar or thought that you need at a particular time is said to be victorious over your subtle powers to be able to adopt a sanskar a habit or a thought during a particular situation it requires a particular skill set to have control over your thoughts over your habits you feel like getting into rage because of a situation but you have control over your thoughts you are in humility you are in peace you are in control of yourself that is known as being victor- victorious over your subtle powers it is the stage of a raj rishi if you order your power of thought to concentrate right away let's say a certain task requires your concentration and there's so much of disturbance around you but you order your thoughts to concentrate at that time at that particular task and your mind accepts that your intellect visualizes only that and your habits are to be there in focus you leave all other things and you make that as a priority then you are like a king whose orders have been listened to so your thoughts your words your thoughts your intellect and your habits have heard you and they are working as per your order so if you order your power of thought to concentrate right away then for the king's orders to be obeyed instantly in that way is a sign of being a master of oneself swarajya adhikari by practicing this you will pass the final paper the final paper when we are leaving our body when we are facing situations where five elements are moving up and down that means calamities are happening when we see our relatives rushing here and there or let's say they are stable they themselves are raj rishis or they are meditators and we have to overcome our attachments to things to people to relatives to even our physical body we have we want to concentrate and focus on supreme creator instead of the world around us then that is going to be the final paper whether we think about him or we think about the five elements we think about the things getting destroyed in front of our eyes we think about the huge noise which is coming because of the destruction or there is uh, other issues which are happening social political issues civil issues which are happening in the world around us or in the city in which we live that is a final paper and we have to pass that for that we have to have concentration for that we have to be a rajrishi and for that we have to be a swarajya adhikari om shanti